All right, next is Mr. Ethan Queen. Hi, my name is Ethan Queen, and I'm going to talk to you about the wonderful world that is business management. So what is the education requirement? So you need to hold at least a bachelor's degree that if you want to work an office job, which you can work an office job or own a business. If you want to work an office job, they most likely will require a bachelor's degree. Master's may be preferred. Just kind of depends on where you work and where you want to. And you need prior experience in the field of business. So like an internship would be really good for that. There's three types of interest. There's finance. You can go into finance. You can go into marketing. Or you can go into accounting. Uh, for my interest, I would like to go into accounting because I'm pretty decent at math. And I feel like that would be the easiest for me to do. Um, you can make in Tennessee between $2,500 and $8,000 a month. And in a different state, you could probably make between $3,500 and $11,000 a month. Uh, my budget, so I do not have a part-time job right now. So my fixed income is negative $82. My controllable is $265. So that would put my balance at about, in the whole, $350. You, any size of business can offer a 401k. Uh, they get Medicare, dental care, eye care, life insurance, and vacation and sick days kind of depends on who you work for and where you go. So most professionals at this position put in at least 40 hours a week. Uh, if you want to own a business, you can really set your own hours, but most of them will work 40 hours a week. Uh, flexible hours and overtime are often required to meet business demands. I plan on owning a business after I get my interest done, so that's what I will be doing. Locations for jobs, there's plenty of business management jobs around. Uh, there's a director of regional sales in Chattanooga. There, you can be an IT manager at US Express in Chattanooga, a business manager of Apple in Atlanta, Georgia, and business manager administration at Macy's in Atlanta. And I think the coolest part about this is that you could go into anywhere you wanted to. Like you can own any business that you want to. And so there's plenty of opportunity for you. Uh, importance of the career portfolio. Uh, showing people my dedications in certain aspects of my life. I played basketball for about 15 years and I never went down from it. So it will show my dedication to that. Uh, show my success in school. I'm currently an honors student with about 3.4, 3.5 GPA. Uh, my resume and my latest recommendation and references are also in there. Uh, an internship is not necessarily required, but it'll help you a lot in what you want to do. Uh, it can get you higher paying jobs, you can make more money, which is what everybody wants. Everybody wants to make more money. So that'll help you. Uh, we'll offer internships to help newcomers ease into the field. So like you're not owning a business and you have no idea what to do, you can go get an internship and the owners of that will kind of put you in the way to be successful. Are there any questions? So what school uh, were you talking about? Uh, I will be going to Cleveland State for the first two years to get my associate's degree in business management, and then I will be transferring to Tennessee West after to get my bachelor's and possibly my master's. What's your backup plan? <laughs> so my backup plan will be in the work. Like I said earlier, you can own a business or you could work in an office job. And I will be working in an office job if my business is not being successful.